Okay, so Chord Magic by Brandy Williams. Um, tapping into the power of string, yarn, twists, and knots. So, as the title suggests, chord, magic, not magic, whatever. Um, so, if that is an important par part or something that you do within your mag magic, magical practice, this book can be of an assistance for you or if you want to get into it um, or into it more, this can be helpful. So, um, like, um, there are different like worksheets and like exercises within the book and like to me, as long as you like source where you got them from, I'm, like you can put them in your own um, journal or whatever, or, like planner, three ring binder, whatever you store stuff in. Um, like if you like if you have this as a like electronic, like an ebook, or got this from your library or from a friend, like you're borrowing it. Um, so. You get um, part one, what ma chord magic basics, so like what it is, um, making a chord, unmaking it. Part two is chord magic design, so you get into stuff like numbers and colors and a few other things. Part three is chord magic projects, so um, kit, specific places and times, and projects. So, um, So like, it's spiritual and go into like different examples, um, red string being maybe tied around a baby's wrist. One possible source of this custom is in the story of Genesis 38. Um, Christians create craft from yarn, like shawls, blankets, and caps. Um, other religi religions connect thread with divine power. Visitors to Hindu temples sometimes receive a thread kala called a kalava. Uh, so, and it explains that and a few other um, religious connections. Um, spinning thread, um, measuring it. So, a, a exercise to twist a cord. Um, this technique creates a cord in minutes. So measure, so like measuring the threads um, as many as you would need and tie and like, so like how to tie the cord, how to make it, and then unmaking the cord and goes into that. So this is an example of like the worksheets. So like this one is um, number meetings, so, so like number one, two, three, and like how, what you associate with those numbers. And so like an example, like, she, like she gives, um, I'm assuming Brandy's a she, um, the author gives an example of, of a filled out, um, like a reference of it and then goes into the mean like different meanings of numbers so like this whole section is about three then it starts with four so um, and then you get references for like colors so you can make your own chart for that um, going into color wheels a little bit of information about that um, and then they, so like orange here yellow so it does go in a bit of information about about that dyes the different type of fibers so you can have your own little quick reference sheet there so like bamboo cotton leather and so on um, history of fabric and the different types um, And 
not store energy, um, store energy exercise, tie a knot, um, but yeah, um, you get a different, like, you do get a bit of a variety of ways to use cord magic, um, So, and like it's delving into this type of magic, uh, if wanting something like physical to have, um, easy like bring to bring with you, like if you make it like as a bracelet or something that you put in your bag or something. So, um, but yeah, it's if you're wanting to have that. Um, cord magic physical type of thing um, with you so yeah cord magic happy readings